to another episode of Teenage Wasteland. So today we're doing a Twinings tea for the first time in a long time. Well, actually, no, I guess not that long. I forgot about the lady gray one, so I guess not that long. But uh, this one, I almost passed up at the store because I saw it was with the holiday twining stuff. And I saw the red box and assumed it was the old flavor that they used to sell in the red box. And I went back through my videos and searched Twinings, found what the old one was, and was like, oh! This is not that! So this is Gingerbread Joy, and I don't know if this is new this year or last year or what, but it is described as lift your spirits this season with ginger, or with the ginger and cinnamon flavors of this irresistible flavored black tea. So there's that. Anything else here? Wait. Yeah! Twinings is delighted to offer this special edition winter tea that celebrates the joy and spirit of the holiday season. Our gingerbread joy is a tempting and decadent blend that combines the finest black teas with the sweet and savory spice flavors of ginger and cinnamon. So whether you are entertaining guests or simply taking a moment for yourself to pause, relax, and recharge, Twinings gingerbread joy is the perfect way to help make this holiday season simply irresistible. They actually do not list the ingredients on the box. So they are black tea, ginger, natural flavor, cinnamon, natural ginger flavor with other natural flavors. So there's not much to be seen anyway, but I just thought it was funny. So I found it interesting that there's not a whole lot of scent from this one, even when you like sniff the bag before you steep it. But even steeped, I was like, it kind of smells like a stale gingerbread cookie. I feel bad saying that. And then I tasted it. And it's like English breakfast tea that thought about a gingerbread cookie one time. It's not a very heavy gingerbread flavor. It's not even what I would necessarily call gingerbread, but it's there a little. But it more tastes like a milder version of their English breakfast tea with like a little bit extra spices in it. So it's like, mmm, okay. All right. Interesting. I think I got spoiled by the Stash brand uh, and everything being so spot on and so vibrant with their flavors that the more subtleties in Twinings, I was like, oh, I'm a little disappointed, not gonna lie. <laughs> I thought this was gonna be stronger, but then I thought about the other holiday flavors they've done. I was like, yeah, I guess those were pretty subtle too, but I'll still drink it. This is already like my third or fourth uh, cup of this stuff, so. I don't dislike it, but I was just like, eh, it, it's not what I was expecting. I thought it was going to have more flavor than that. The aftertaste, kind of, also that, like, stale gingerbread cookie flavor, I was like, oh. Alright. So that's a thing. <laughs> Alright. Um, I'll go through this box, but I don't know that I would repurchase it again. I think for me, it's probably going to be like... Maybe a two out of five. Like, it's a really, like, a barely, barely constitutes as gingerbread at all. But the fact that it's, like, not just gingerbread, but it's specifically stale gingerbread. And then on top of that, it's also barely there. I'm like, what the hell? I just bought this. This literally is not expired or anything before anyone suggests that. It's good until 2025. So, like is well within the range <laughs> so I'm like I don't know man you get like the warmth of the ginger on your tongue I'll give it that but like it's more ginger than gingerbread which is a little disappointing but it is what it is I am knocking stuff down off of here cool anyway let's put those back up <laughs> Anywho, um yeah it, it's not the greatest one they've definitely done better holiday flavors before but again I, I will drink this up, but I'm like, ooh, 20 bags feels like a lot with this all of a sudden. How many do we have left? We have <laughs> 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Oh, I guess it's only my third cup. Never mind. <laughs> I thought it was my fourth. But yeah, so I was like, mm, it's okay. It's just okay, but it's it's nothing to write home about. I wouldn't really go out of my way for this one. There's definitely better gingerbread teas on the market than this one. It's kind of just like, eh. Not really feeling it on this one. 
But that's just my opinion. I'm sure you guys have your own opinions of these things. And if you've tried this one, I'd love to hear your opinion down in the comments. But anyway, as usual, you guys know what to do. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. If you're not already and you'd like to be, click subscribe. Hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload. Leave comments down below. Make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Instagram, my eBay, my Reddits, everything and more. It's all down below. And if you like what I do here on this channel and you'd like to help support it, the donation link, as always, is down in the description. Anyway, guys, until next time, see ya.